I don't know, man. I don't know. I feel like with how much information is easily accessible now, people should be more knowledgeable on subjects. At least before they talk about them. Like, information is so easily accessible these days. Like... Like, it's so easily accessible. I feel like there's no excuse to be talking about something that you're not knowledgeable about. <laughs> Looking things up takes so much time, not worth. I mean, true, though. True. That's the thing, like, ignorance is bliss. You know what I mean? Like, if you don't know that you're wrong, you don't think you're wrong. You know what I mean? That's one of the things. Like, challenging your own reality can be a very scary thing for people. Like, legitimately. And it's feelings and opinions over facts now. That is kind of how it feels. Now it is. <laughs> Just spew straight facts and wisdom from my brain. Um... People don't like to challenge their own reality nowadays, I feel like. Like, it, 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 it's, it's, it's too scary. It's like, what's the benefit, you know what I mean? As long as I feel like I'm right, then I'm right. That's, like, I'm, I'm saying that in quotations. That's what it feels like people think. Um, I don't think that they think that outwardly. I think it's more of a subconscious thing. It's like, subconsciously, they feel right. So they don't desire the truth because they've already acquired the feeling that they desire, which is feeling right. That's what they that's what they want. They don't want to feel right and be correct. They just want to feel right. That's the thing. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. I also feel like the, the internet has gotten very echo chambery over like because of the way that it's set up. I feel like it's gotten very echo chambery. So people with wrong opinions will surround themselves with other people with the same wrong opinion. And so they'll validate each other to the point where they feel like they're so right, like they can't be wrong. And if they encounter anybody who tells them otherwise, they'll go back to their echo chamber and they'll be like, hey, listen, th this person said I was wrong. And then everybody will collectively validate them. And they'll feel like they're right because there's so many more people, like the, the herd mentality of, oh, well, all these people around me say that that person was wrong. So obviously I'm right because so many people think, think I'm, think I'm, think I'm right. So I think that's a very dangerous thing that's kind of come to from the internet. I, I like oh god there's a great thing i fucking retweeted actually it's one of my favorite 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 uh mentality things i've seen recently Let me see if I can find it. I think I retweeted it. It was a while ago. Man, I have so I, I fucking retweet so many good things. I retweet so many good things. I don't understand why it isn't more socially acceptable to choose to be nocturnal. The angry hot sky ball is gone. My internet is fast. Everyone is finally shut up. What's not to like? <laughs> it's so true. It's so true. You can be a kind person with a good heart and still tell people to fuck off when needed. I very much resonate with that. 
Oh, fuck, I can't find it, what I'm looking for. We should have a national quiet day where everyone just shuts up for 24 hours. Dude, that would be legendary. I really want that to happen. I would love that. Can't find it. Fuck, I can't find it. What was it? What was it? Let me think. Fuck, what was I talking about? He's the only one speaking the truth. <laughs> That's fair. Um. Oh, it was it was about whether like it, it was something about something about that it doesn't need to be. There doesn't need to be the majority for an opinion to be right. It was something about that. It was a really great post. Fuck, wh where was it? Did I not retweet it? Maybe I didn't retweet it. Oh, fuck. If it's in my likes, it's going to take fucking forever to find. Hmm. My 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 likes are <laughs> it's funny because I like a retweet such like cynical shit. <laughs> um uh, less a retweet. I try and I try and um uh I try and retweet less sad stuff. Some people can stay at home for two days without going out and they are not even bothered. Sad face. Motherfucker, I stayed in my house for like over a year. Like over a year. And I really was not that bothered by it at all. <laughs> it really does not bother me. It's always a strange thing to me. Fuck, I don't know. I don't know if I can find it. Fuck, I liked it so much though that I've remembered it and it must have been ages ago. Shit. I really wish I could find it now. Yeah, I have so many good likes. <laughs> There's a guy with his shirt. Pet kitties, suck titties, spend fitties. <laughs> That's a fucking great shirt. A great shirt. Need to oh, fuck. I really want to find this now. I'm 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 like I'm mad. I really want to find this. Fuck, what was it? Bad.
fuck? How far back do I have to go? <laughs> this, this, I'm nice, but I'm an asshole. But my heart is big as fuck. But I don't really give a fuck. But I care sometimes. But fuck everybody. If that makes sense. <laughs> I resonate with that so much more than I really should. <laughs> I resonate with that so much more than I really should. I can't find it, man. I'm mad. Hmm. I'm mad. Uh, it's basically the ad popular and fallacy, arguing that something is true or right because lots of people believe it. Uh, been a very visible argument fallacy since uh, someone entered politics. Kind of <laughs> um, arguing that something is true or right because lots of people believe it. No, yeah, yeah. I, I, there is such a great like post for it. I can't believe that I can't find it. I really can't find it. How how fucking long ago was this? I'm kind of mad it was so long ago. I read this. This is really interesting. One of the most frightening things I've ever heard is when someone pointed out to me that the existence of the uncanny valley feeling implies that at some point in our evolution, there was a reason to be afraid of something that looked like a human, but wasn't actually. That's kind of a fucking terrifying thought. That's not something I enjoyed reading. <laughs> that was not something that I enjoyed reading. <laughs>